What's up guys, welcome to VFX Friday, the show that's dedicated to all people who want to be good at editing and sound EVX or VFX. Now I'm your host Editator Nabil and today we're gonna do some sound editing. What is sound editing? It's thanks to edit your voice to be better and today we're gonna do it on Sony Vegas 13, yeah, but you can do it also in Sony Vegas 12 or 11 or 10 or 9 or etc. As long as it's all basic, it's all basic, it has the plugins, plugins here sorry plugins here is all basic plugins so you can do it on any Sony Vegas Pro software so uh, today we're gonna change this kind of voice looks better so I got this recorder built in from my f from my phone and it's really bad a uh, voice so let's try to hear it what's up people of Robert broadcasting me from my house and watching me again now I'm gonna talking about sound design yeah maybe for some people that sounds good but for me it's not because it's really treble in a high treble and it has noise so what we gonna make is kinda like this what's up people of Robert broadcasting me from my house and watching me again now I'm gonna talking about sound design yeah so much better than before so let's try look to the first or to the bottom layer and duplicate it or you can just drag out this thing to the timeline yeah i'm doing it because i'm currently have the old one okay so let's try to hear it one more time but only the first one what's up people of robert broadcasting from my house and watching me again Okay, that sounds good, but I need improvements or like um, uh, another uh, like things. Okay, I want to have a good voice, but I don't have enough money to buy a shotgun mic or to buy a zoom or something like that. So let's try in sound editing. I have uh, this kind of plugins and let's choose uh, track EQ. Why I'm using track EQ because um, uh, it's better for me. Okay. Uh, uh, some people will ask why not you use the track EQ on the preset or default preset on the track. Why? Because I want to edit this file only, not all the track. Why? Because when I edit this one only, it kind of hurt bad, and also I have the original one, so it won't uh, it won't sound bad. So uh, let's move on. Okay, so we have this track EQ now, and we have this four points here. Yeah, one, two, three, and four. Uh, let's see the second one first, and uh, change the frequency to 300 stuff sorry that's my mom okay so um, the second point let's um, around 200 or uh, yeah around 200 yeah and uh, boost the decibels to 5 or 6.5 around that yep yeah that's it 6.5 and make the so it will uh, produce a curve so make the curve looks white like this yeah that's good okay that's good now move to the third one the third one we ma we want to make this frequency to uh, 3k around 3k or this one okay around this around this frequency and we want to lower the gain because we don't want something that uh, too treble or too uh, high pitched are too echoing so we remove the gain or we decrease the decibel to around 6.52 like so or 6.3 that's good or 6.9 and like uh, like always make it white like this okay that's done next we move to the first one or, or uh, this one is good it's good so you can finish in this point yeah Let's try to hear it. What's up, people of Robert broadcasting from my house and watching me again? Now I'm gonna talking about sound design. Yeah, that's good enough for me. And uh, but um, I want something that much better than this. So we added the first point and the fourth point. So the first one, okay, it's the low shelf. It's control all the way down below the point, right? 
So what I'm gonna do is to move this point to around 81 or 80 uh, and change the gain to minus 6.5 we want to remove uh, some of the noise and change the roll off or the kind of thing to 24 so we want a sharp thing yeah a sharp thing like so and we move to the fourth one we change it to around 10k around 10k or precisely 10k okay 10k we move it to 10k and make the gain and lower the gain like before but let's try 5.5 Okay, around 5.5 and change the roll off to 24 so it looks uh, curvy like so. Okay, we've done this, done that. Let's try to hear it one more time. What's up, people of your broadcasting from my house and I'm watching me again. Now I'm gonna talking about sound design. Yeah, much much better. But I know uh, I'm not. Uh, not feel good yet because what because this noise right noise I want to remove the noise but I don't know how but let me show you how to do it so let's check the plugin and we have um, noise gate here okay noise gate we change it okay like so and then just play it what's up people of our broadcasting from my house and watching me again now I'm gonna talking about sound design. Yeah, much better. But yeah, it's up to you. You can control the threshold level from zero dB to infinite. Anything you want. Make sure that you pronounce the word. Uh, you pronounce the word completely, and you don't have things that cut it. And also, the wind is um, destroyed. Or yeah. I use that word. Okay, so yeah, I guess that's it. That's how to make this voice. Words up. Words up. Yeah, that's good. So yeah, I guess that's it for today. Thank you for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, and yeah, uh, don't forget to watch another episode of VFX Friday next Friday, and also watch um, uh, our videos on Saturday at. Uh, 8 p uh, at 3 p 3 a.m. maybe uh, that must be Friday at 8 p.m. I don't know okay so thank you for watching have a nice day and see you in the next episode of VFX Friday ciao